Nate Creeper who we're playing later on today. Um, I'm very much looking forward to it. Um, as you can see, they're getting warmed up. Is that water? That is water. It's deceptive, isn't it? I thought you guys were on the beer already. Just uh, water. Take, taking it seriously for later on. So, yeah. Gotta stay hydrated. Oh, well, 100%. I've already been on the beer a little bit myself. But, uh, yeah, so um, a friend of mine, uh, another colleague of mine, uh, he is very keen for you guys to come back to Glasgow at some point, by the way. And he was insistent that I got that in nice and early because uh, he wants to see you back up there at some point. We will be. Yeah, yeah, good, sure. good. He, he, will, he will love that answer. Um, and um, so, you know, uh, how, how's, how's the journey been down here? You guys all keyed up, ready for today? Yeah, I mean, we're, it's mostly festivals that we're playing. Yeah. We're here for about three weeks playing, I don't know, 10 festivals or so. Yeah. Some club shows in between. We just played a couple uh, headline club shows, played a couple festivals already. We're about the, at the halfway point right now. Fantastic. And how are you feeling? You Tired, but yeah, it's yeah, feeling good. It's tiring. Yeah, you know, you gotta fly and then ride, and ride and fly and ride and fly. But yeah, it's fun I mean, we love it. It's been enough years now that you're used to it, though, right? So uh, that, that's all good. Um, so uh, it's been a few years since since Israel came out and stuff like that. And yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry, Israel joined the band rather. So um, yeah. how what sort of influences has he brought in? Has it changed anything? I think he has a great stage presence. Yeah. He's a great live performer, which yeah. is awesome. I really like his energy, and I feel like we all mesh with him live. Yeah, he's also very good at guitar yeah, which I yeah like. that, that helps. he's he's a shredder i'd call him a shredder yeah. and so i feel like he's been able to add some of that to some of our newer material um that'll come out and uh yeah he's just a great guitar player and he pushes me to be a better guitar player too that, so he has his own style and i love it yeah bounce backwards forwards off each other absolutely uh, spots on and that come through on stage uh etc and all that sort of stuff as well yeah i gotta be honest it's the first time seeing you live for me so i'm quite excited Awesome. Yeah. Um, uh, it's, it's been brilliant. I only got into you guys a little while ago because um, the same guy that asked me about Glasgow uh, has been telling me that I've got to listen to you guys for ages. <laughs> and I, I got round to it coming to this festival. Very impressed. So thank you very much uh, for yeah, yeah, so yeah, for sure. this festival. Um, so uh, old school death metal. All right, uh, what's, what's kind of your views on the old school stuff nowadays uh, with the way that things are coming through? Uh, you see, you know, is it still got a place? Should people go back and look at the back catalogue? And yeah, I mean, I know that we we did, when we started the band, we were influenced by you know a lot of uh, the classic death metal bands. Um, I think that there's a lot of uh, new, old school death metal bands. Um, yeah. I'm not really sure uh, if the the term old school death metal is just being used, overused now is okay, just yeah, like yeah. As, as the new type of death metal. Yeah. Um, but we're definitely inspired by the classics for sure. Okay, um, which classics? Give me a couple. Uh, I mean, like definitely obvious ones of our are the Swedish death metal, Dismember, Entomb. I, I heard you guys um, love the Swedish sounds. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But we also love Obituary, Cannibal Corpse. Yeah, um, yeah. yeah all yeah. that stuff. So. Fantastic. Um, and uh, have you guys got many interviews lined up today? Because I know this is this is probably the hardest part for you guys, right? You just want to come and play, and you yeah. want to speak to us uh, and all that sort of stuff. Um, uh, do you get any time to like downtime to like sit, chill, watch the bands, side stage, or anything like that? Uh, just depends on the schedule. Yeah. We'll, we'll be able to watch some bands today. Yeah. yeah. Uh, who are you looking forward to watching today? In Flames. In Flames. Yeah. yeah. Uh, everyone's been talking about In Flames. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, Candlemas too. Candlemas, yeah. Uh, everyone's staying around for Candlemas. Yeah. Uh, we see them as a proper proper headliner tonight, to be fair, even though we're all going to watch Kill Switch as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah, off to Candlemas straight afterwards. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah, are you going to be the tent with the crowd or are you going to be side stage or? Probably both. Yeah, I like to mix it up. I like to see what it's like, to yeah. see how the band's set up and their, their rigs, and then I'll go out in front and just, because we're just. Fair play. Uh, are you. Are you um, yeah, are you recognised much over here nowadays? Yeah, on and off, yeah, for sure. Yeah, so uh, you're in the crowd, you're gonna gonna end off as you people get fan fan and uh, yeah, take some pictures. <laughs> yeah, they like, love meeting our fans too, so it's fun. Yeah. We enjoy that. Fantastic. Um, well, uh, it's only a very short interview uh, with me today, as you'll be pleased to hear. We're gonna do like five minute interviews. Um, but what have you guys got next? What's you know, we've got anything in the pipeline um, being recorded? Um, yeah. Uh, we just finished our, our new record. We just finished it the, the day before we came here, or the day we did come here. Um, it still needs to be mixed and mastered and everything, So, but it'll be out next year on Nuclear Blast. Nuclear Blast, fantastic label as well. Um, yeah. they, uh, they look after everybody properly, and it's yeah, you can't go wrong with Nuclear Blast. Yeah. Uh, you've yeah. been with a few labels now, haven't you? Uh, yeah. So Nuclear Blast most recent. Yeah. Uh, when did you sign with them again? 
Uh, we signed with them almost two or three years ago, but it was like during the pandemic. We had just released our new, yeah. our last record EP. Uh, so it, they've been patient with us, waiting for. It, for How did the record. pandemic kind of hit you guys? Because it hit a lot of bands very hard, especially the bands that toured the UK, but yeah. are from from the US and that. It hit yeah. a lot of them hard. I mean, we couldn't tour for a year and a half, two years. Yeah. And the ones we did, we had some touring to catch up to. So yeah. that's why we didn't. We, it took so long to do our, our new record, is because we were just. As soon as we were able to, we, we started touring and we've been doing that for the last two years. So we had to take a break this year from touring to get our record done. So yeah. this is the first thing that we've done all yeah. year. Are you having a, a break, a bit of family time and stuff like that back yeah. home at some point soon? Yeah. yeah. How long is this tour for? Three weeks. About three weeks. So you already got how far into it? A week and a half into it? We're at the halfway point, I believe. I'll oh, but you're looking forward to getting home now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We love it here. It's nice. It's yeah. really hot back home. This weather's really nice here. Uh, I guess, yeah, you get it back Aside home. Aside from the rain that's been ruining it. So the yeah, last year, if you were here, it was like back home. Uh, it was horrific. Yeah, it was. Uh, we last here year. summer, too. Oh, you were here last summer? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, that was horrific. So you got a nicer year this year. Yeah, yeah this uh, is you, excellent. Are you going to be letting your hair down after the gig? Are you going to be having a few beers? Yeah. Fantastic. Be yeah. Um, so I look forward to seeing you guys in the pit then, hopefully at some point later on. Um, it's been very nice chatting to you. Thank you so much. Uh, take care. And I look forward to your set uh, very, very much. And uh, Ricky looks forward to seeing you in Glasgow. Uh, he's Ricky Marshall Times and he wants to do a video interview with you at some point. And he's, he's a proper fan girl. So I'll get him in touch. All right.